Hello everyone, it's Atrasky here, back at it again with Nora and her family. She's the teen pregnancy series. <laughs> forgot what part this is but we're far along into this story where we're almost at the end and this might be the last video because our kids are pretty much grown. Anyways, Benny's asking for advice so let's see what he's saying. He was a witness to a bully. Some kids at school were being mean to one of my friends. I wanted to help but I didn't know what to do. What do you think I should have done? Honestly, both is valid. You know, sometimes standing up to a bully might cause more ruckus. Hmm. I don't know. I don't want my kid to get beat up but at the same time it is very honorable. Here, I'll say step in and stand up for your friend. He gained conflict resolution increases. Manner decreases. Oh no. Okay, here's Nora. She's looking old. <laughs> if you remember our last episode, uh, Wilson aged up to a teenager. So he's really the age that Nora was when we first started this series. Isn't that crazy? We should make him get a girl pregnant. <laughs> No, for real. <gasps> you know, follow your mommy's footsteps. More like your daddy's because you're going to be getting a girl pregnant. What is he doing? He's eating some cake. And Nora's pretty sad about her breakup still. She really misses Malcolm, but she doesn't know how to express it. Wait, when's Benny's birthday? I think it's coming up, isn't it? Oh, it's coming up Sunday. That means he'll be a teenager too. I low-key want to see him be a teenager before we end this series. This is cute. Malcolm's sentiments about Wilson. He's impressed. Wilson sure knows what he is doing and Malcolm has nothing but respect. That is actually so cute. He's impressed by his son already. Oh, Benny has a strict relationship with him. It's very awkward. Broken up. Super siblings. Let's just ignore that. That's so weird. I remember when I found that out. Oh, Nora has custody of Malcolm's child. Yes, yeah, she does. Nora is a people person, so the decline of her friendship with Malcolm is painful. And also, you guys were literally together, almost married. How do we have super siblings with our child? It literally says son right here. She's supportive, child in Nora's custody. Nora adores Benny and growing closer. And then Benny has closer from happy memories, aw. And then Wilson and her are good friends, super siblings again child in Nora's custody. Oh, she's strict with Wilson. So they're the opposite. Mom is strict with Wilson and dad is strict with Benny. And then they have like opposite. Well, I guess it evens out. At least they're not teaming up on one child. <laughs> Vibing out before school starts. Game loading is in progress. Bro, should have saw that sooner. I have to exit and come back. It's been happening a lot. I don't know why. Ever since the update, it's been doing this to me. Send flirty text. Oh, we low-key can though. He's at the bottom for a reason, but you know. Oh gosh, let's see what he says. Oh, okay. Well, we sent him it. I don't think he'll like it, but yeah, Malcolm didn't care. Yeah, come on, I sent you a nice flirty text. Actually, he might be sleeping. Maybe he'll call us later. Who knows? Oh yeah, I forgot it's Winterfest. Okay, Benny, eat up and then we're gonna go to thrifty and do a little thrifting. Maybe run into a cute girl, you know? I'm at that age now. Soon enough, you will be too, Benny. The way they're just eating cake for breakfast is so funny. Benny just has to hop in the shower and then we can head out. I guess I kind of see Nora in him. I just feel like he looked a lot like his dad. So mom, can I have some money so I can go? Why is he tense? Oh, the stressies from strict family dynamic. Oops. Okay, Benny, stay nearby, but do whatever the frick you want. I don't care. Let's get some thrifting in. Maybe find something good. What the heck is Benny doing? <gasps> um, are you a police officer? We're all ordering at once. Oh no, Benny's talking to strangers, isn't he? Oh no, this is how kids get abducted. We're watching her. How she makes the bubble tea. Or boba tea, whatever. Oh, okay, the machine makes it for you, I see. Oh, Wilson's going over there. Not popping. It's boring here so far. But I mean, it is early, so give it time. Come grab this dude. Um, another person with a gun or weapon? What was that? Um... Girl, what are you wearing? And what do you have? You gonna kill a vampire? I guess I mean there are vampires in this world, so makes sense. Here, we'll just chat with this random girl. I'll just be a little nice to her. Oh no, where'd Benny go? 
Oh, he's upstairs. I didn't even know there was an upstairs to this. What the? What is this place? Um, be careful. Oh, he's the thrift store owner. What? I never knew about this place up here. Okay. Well, we're sitting and chatting. We could what try flirting. Name? She is an older woman. We'll ask her if she's single. Wilson doesn't care about age. Oh, she's married. Mm. She's not even a young adult. She's just an adult. Like, <laughs> what a bad couple. Oh, does he have friends? Didn't he meet people at school? Uh, yep. No, he, I guess he didn't. I thought he did. That's kind of sad. His glasses are great. I love it. Well, we shopped and we chatted a little bit. Maybe we should head somewhere else now. Oh, who's this? Someone famous? Hold up, hold up. Judith Ward? In disguise? Oh my gosh, ask her for a hug. Oh, is it a blizzard out? It's cold. Judith! What, you're too famous? Come on, you always say no. She doesn't want a selfie? She's mean. I already asked her for a hug. How am I supposed to be like nice to her? She doesn't want a selfie. She doesn't want a hug. Fine, I'll get an autograph. Maybe. She probably won't even do that for me. What am I- What? Wow. Judith, I'm gonna turn into your biggest hater if you're gonna be like that. Benny's still vibing up here, but let's go, Benny. I'm having bad experiences here. We'll go back to our town and we can go to this cafe. Or would the gym be better? Or even go out to the nightclub, but we can't bring Benny, can we? <gasps> That's bad. We'd be a bad brother. You know what? No. We'll bring Benny home. Drop him off and be like, okay, mom, now I wanna go hang out with my uncle. And you know, our uncles are the cool uncles. Okay, bye, Benny. See you later. We got Malik and Theodore. We'll go with Theodore. He is the more chill because he's younger. We're a little closer. Nightclub it is. Let's get turned. Look at his makeup. He looks cool. Hey, Uncle Theodore. Ready to party it up? Oh, yeah. Time to get turned. Oh, Wilson's feeling nice and confident. I've got this. Wilson knows what he is capable of. Oh, yeah. Dancing it up with our uncle. Okay, well, this is fun. There's no girls or anything. Oh, look, everyone came. Party's all here. Oh my gosh, it's weird seeing him as a young adult. He was in Nora's grade. Time flies. Oh yeah, Wilson's really feeling that music. She looks pregnant. <laughs> okay, uncle, I think it's time to go. I think we should go to the cafe now where we told mom we are going. So at least we know the menu and stuff can't go back home looking dumb mom will ask questions and also her old classmates here and we're gonna get caught oh my gosh actually she doesn't talk to him so we're good where we were supposed to go is the cafe so let's go there we had a little fun at the nightclub dance for two hours let loose sadly no potential girls we saw no one was cute enough so we're just vibing out with our uncle okay it's been a while since we hung in. Perfect time, he's hungry. Our uncle's still a teenager too, that's perfect. That even makes it better. Theodore has to take care of himself. Oh my gosh, I can't do that for you. What the, this girl's cute. And she just stood right next to him. Um, guys, are they cute or what? <laughs> well, my uncle's going to the bathroom. Might as well try to hit it off with this girl. Let's see if she's gonna laugh at us or not. Oh. So she liked that. Let's see. Is she single? She is single. Okay, that's perfect for us. Perfect. Let's tease her a little bit. Oh, we just minused out. Why? Here, let's discuss our interests. <gasps> no, don't leave. Don't leave. In perfect time, our uncle came down and now we can chill with him. Perfect. And we both got our food at the same time. We're in sync right now. It's kind of weird. Literally in sync. <laughs> Grab their food and all at the same time. Oh, Wilson's a foodie. I don't remember that for some reason. Ooh, let's become best friends forever for sure. Oh, yeah. Besties. They have a cute relationship. It's really late. We should probably get home before we both get in trouble. Hey, but we're both young and naive and we're supposed to have fun, right? That's how it is. And hey, we're with our family members, so it's okay. Anyways, bye Theodore. Have a good night. I'm headed home. Oh gosh, where's our mom? Oh, she's dancing right here. Let's just run into our room and ignore her. Are you mad, Nora? Don't get mad. Come on, you should know. Okay. She's okay. Nora's so lazy. All she's eating is this cake. Like, come on, cook a meal. 
Nora needs to get to painting. They're broke. Oh no, she has to do her homework. Ugh. So after she paints, she's gonna do homework. She's happy. She's finally getting into painting again now that she's not as depressed as she was before. Nora's taking so long to do this, and she's gonna take longer now that Benny's trying to talk to her. There we go. Ooh, and we can sell it for a good chunk of money. Yes, sir. Nora just casually coming into this room to do her homework in this little comfy chair. Oh goodness, our fridge broke. Oh, time to go to class with Wilson. Living our youth through Wilson again. Maybe Wilson should hang out with his dad soon. We don't see him too often. Whoa, <gasps> I like this girl's hair. So we got our bestie here, I love that. He's like, you caught my eye. I freaking love your hair, girl. Ooh, here's a cheerleader up in here. What's wrong with her eye? Is it a birthmark or something? We'll do a friendly introduction with her. She seems more our league. We're just all chatting. What club is he in? What is that? Oh, she got close to Wilson. She likes him, huh? This is the girl that has a crush on him, and this is the girl he kind of likes, and then the other girl he's crushing hard on. But they ended off wrong. She literally didn't like him at the end, which is kind of sad. Look at them. They're like eyeballing each other. They're staring dead in each other's eyes. These two are killing the vibe. They're like fighting or something. I don't know. Let's have Malcolm work out on one of the machines because can't lie, he should anyways, and it says to. Oh, he won't be able to. Morning class ends already. It's okay. He hung out with his buddies here. Let's ask this girl if she's single, which we already know though because she low-key likes us and we know it. We're nice and confident. This girl can be his bestie. I think she's a best friend material for sure. Tala is single. Um, guys, do we have to get to class or what? We have to attend our business class. Oops, we're late. Oh, she's in our class too. Perfect. Sorry, we're both late. We were just chatting too much. But we're finally here. Wait, just in time. Oh. Psych, we just missed like the whole class. Wow, way to go, Wilson. You're gonna get bad grades now. Well, it's lunchtime. Wait, was she in this class too or is she coming to us? We're all late. <laughs> Hey, this could be fun. Theodore wants to go to prom with- Oh my gosh. Theodore. No. You can find a girlfriend. You're a good looking fella. Uh, no way. Yes. I feel mean. <laughs> is that gonna ruin our relationship? Please don't. It went down a little bit, but it, it's okay. Oh, it's career day? Okay, let's ask about these careers. Astronaut, chef, um, something. The way he's behind him. Oh my gosh. Theodore, didn't you just ask me? No, I said no. I'm so sorry. He's gonna make our relationship become zero. Are you for real, buddy? I have to apologize. I don't want our relationship to be ruined, but read the room. I literally said no already. I literally have an interest right here. Okay, I just said sorry to Theodore. I believe he understands us, so let's get back to the career day, please. Now let's ask this guy. Just cut right in front of everyone and be like, hey, so I have a question. Prom is coming! Oh crap, we have to do this, we have to. Let's reveal our crush, let's tell her. Oh, Wilson was going to go to Theodore. I'm sorry, Theodore. Wilson's a big boy. He's gonna reveal his crush, let's see. Oh, never mind. Go to work? Wait, what? Oh, drama club, that's where he is. Oh no, someone needs to repair a house. You know what, Benny? You have to invite your dad over. Dad, our fridge isn't working, and mom is at college, and Wilson's at drama class. He'll be right over. Awesome. Our dad comes in clutch. Impressive person alert. Bask in the glow of someone impressive. Is he impressed by his daddy? Probably. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh, Benny, is this a setup? Wait, I forgot. We're not controlling him. I wanted Malcolm to repair it, but technically he can't because I would have to add him to my family. For some reason, once I add someone to my family, I can't remove them with the cheat. It's like glitched or something. So we're just gonna have Nora do that, and Malcolm's here now. Oh, Theodore's calling to chat. Wanna answer? Theodore loves him. They really are besties, huh? Aw, he missed his dad. Malcolm looks a little sad. Hey, but he's dancing. Oh, okay, Wilson upgraded to practical performer. Here, Nora, try to brighten his day. Try to chat with him. Dance with him, maybe. The way Wilson just came in the middle. Right now we're dancing together. Oh, we're happy. Like old times. Aw, for real. Look at them bonding. See, even if they don't get back together, they can be friends, I hope. Wilson's loving it too. 
Oh, they're doing their secret handshake. Was oh, that it? <laughs> oh! Aww, this is too cute. I want him to make a prom proposal, so let's create one. They're still chatting away. Let's apologize to him. Show him how sorry we are. Benny trying to hang out with us. What is he spraying? Oh, I forgot. He's doing his prom proposal. He's getting all gross. Oh, yeah. Gotta impress the girl you like. I can't believe this is them now. Aw, this family. Crazy how everyone just grew up. Oh my gosh, he's gonna go blind. Like, Malcolm, you're looking good. And Benny's gonna be turning into a teenager soon. They're all gonna grow up too fast. He's like, I should get going. See you guys later. Cute. Well, I think that was a good little hangout. We probably should sell that now. Then we'll have her paint a figure painting. And then she definitely will have to do homework, won't she? And she also has to write some term papers. So much stuff to do for her. Yes, get to run in. Gotta look good for your prom. Where's his prom proposal? I need to see how it turned out. Its quality is good. There's something special about a self-made prom proposal. Sign. This grand gesture is sure to have them say yes, right? Maybe you should have spent more time in the art room. But all this effort is sure to make an impression they'll never forget. I wish I could see it. He needs to do his homework as well, so we're gonna have him do that too. Can't let our grades slip. Laura, it looks fantastic. <laughs> Benny's just vibing. Benny, you're gonna have to do your homework too, buddy. You're not escaping that world either. Who's this girl that you're thinking about? Become friends with her? The heck is that? Benny's taking his desk over. He's savage for that. This is kind of cute. They're both doing their homework in his room. Aww. Time to go to school. Oh, look who's right in front of us, too. Our girl. Should we ask her to prom right now? Yes, I think the time is perfect. You know, before class, so we have time. Present prom proposal sign. Let's do it. Might as well. Wait, what if she says no because our love is so little? Maybe I should have built it up a little more. We'll see. Wait, prom's tomorrow though, right? Oh, he's doing it, he's doing it. Oh, she said yes? Yay! We're going to prom together. That's amazing. Yes, I will totally go to prom with you. I love that. Aww, we're going to prom together. I'm so happy with her. Well, guys, I'm glad she said yes. Guys, I have him queued up for a bunch of things. Like, come on, do it. He's wasting time. Successful prom proposal. They said yes. Yeah, and now you guys are just staring at each other. Oh, look at this. Little sentiment. Okay, finally, he's gonna start talking and stuff. Even though class is about to start. That's so annoying. They literally stood there the whole time. Oh, yeah, I get to flirting. Ooh, should we have our first kiss of the same day? He got the riz riz. Aww. They're precious. First kiss. Okay, let's not be late for class this time. Let's go, girl. Oh, we have an exam. I haven't studied or anything. I'm gonna do so bad. Okay, we're not late. That's good. We're actually two minutes early. Is our girlfriend late? Where is she? Maybe this is a different class. Oh, goodness. We're taking an exam. I really hope he does good. Huh? Wait, lunch? I'm confused. Why was class so short? Everyone's still doing their stuff, though. He's going all the way downstairs. But let's be friendly with a student. Let's go to a girl and ask her, how ask her how she did on the exam. Because it says be friendly with a student, so might as well. Oh my gosh. Theodore, stop! I already have a prom date. He's so weird. Literally, my prom date's right here. Look, what is that? No! Okay, where are you, Theodore? Come on now. He's walking all sad. And our friendship is so low, all because he wants to go to prom. Like, come on. You've asked me three times, and I've said the same freaking answer. Okay, we're trying to apologize. Hopefully he is good. He's very sad about it. See, he needs to get to know my girl. And then he'll realize, you know? He'll respect us. And say you are my favorite. Don't worry. You're still my best friend. And look, she's talking to him too. He shouldn't feel left out. Yeah. Trying to make him feel better. What am I saying? Aw, see, you're still my favorite, buddy. We're vibing out together. What is our sentiment, though? Right here, creeped out? Wilson didn't think that Theodore was at the level of best friends yet. Maybe some space will help 
What? The way he's literally his uncle. We'll get through this. We're family. We have to. Well, I gotta go make my way to my class. So see you guys later. Time to take this exam. Are you taking your exam? Where's your notebook or whatever? I don't know. I have a bad feeling that he's gonna freaking do so bad. Oh, he's getting up. He's very confident, but bro, you're supposed to be doing your exam. Well, it's done now. What's up, Theodore? He's like, look at this funny video. We got drama class in 30 minutes. <gasps> oh, Wilson failed a test. Impossible. This won't happen again. One F is one too many. Wilson failed his exams. Did he even show up? Yes. Yes, I did. Oh my gosh, and Nora's late for class because she's at work. <gasps> Bro, it's because a stupid update makes my sims just stand around. There we go. We sent her off to class. Wilson has drama class soon. Flunked. Maybe Wilson should have studied some at all. I'm sorry, he's been too focused. Now he has looming anxiety. Oh, he's late. Come on, go. Okay, he's going. It's not work, it's drama class, but... He's off to drama class. Gonna make him work hard. Nora is at class. She's gonna take some notes. And Benny's here chilling, watching some TV. Well, guys, I'm gonna end this episode here, but we have a lot in the future, actually. Wilson got a prom day. Benny's gonna grow up soon. I can't wait to see him a teenager. I wonder what he's gonna look like. He's gonna look so cute, I bet. And Nora is in college. Oh, Nora just got home. She put in enough work to get a decent grade out of that class. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hit the subscribe button down below to join my gang and, you know, get notified when I upload. And also on your way out, if you could like this video, it'll help me out a lot. I appreciate you all. You guys have a great day or night and peace out.